Hey, what's going on? I'll play a little bit of this song and I'll teach it to you right afterwards. goes over and over again. I'll show you some ideas behind it and what you can kind of do. I'm keeping on the first fret. Um, so let's go over these chords. So I'm working on an A minor. This guy's on the second fret, fourth string. These guys are on the third fret, um, first and second string, relative to the capo, of course. It's like an A minor seven works as my A minor. E minor, second fret on the fifth string and fourth string. These guys remain out on the first and second. It's like an E minor seven. Um, then D, second fret on that third string. It's a D sus4, which is my D. Um, all right, so it just kind of goes between that A minor, E minor, D. A minor ends it and starts it over again. All right, so let's talk about that finger picking pattern that I was doing. So uh, with that. Uh, I was going five for the A minor. I'm going five, three, two, one, two, three. Good. When I go to the E minor, I go from the sixth string and then six, three, two, one, two, three, six, two, three, one, two, three. D, I'm going from the fourth string. Four, three, two, one, two, three, four, two, three, one, two, three. Back to that A minor on the five. Let's do that a couple times. Start from the A minor. E minor. D. A minor. And then if you're just strumming out, you can just kind of go from A minor. do some strumming in between it. Um, just a couple ideas behind it. It's nice because it just goes through those same three chords over and over again the whole song. How to play it. Hope it helps and uh, thank you for watching. See ya.